There's another, I preached this message sometime. Nobody, somebody, everybody. But uh, I'd love to preach that. <laughs> <laughs> Praise the Lord. <laughs> <laughs> but Isn't that uh, something? Uh, but I, I thought I thought of a black man that told this uh, story about his life. Said how that uh, when he was a young man, they were some holiness people as having church near him, having revival, and said, we boys went down and, and we um, um, peppered them with tomatoes and uh, eggs. He said they kept shouting. Said the next night we went down there and we took, uh, we took snuff and we put it on the palms of our hands and we'd blow it said they'd sneeze and keep shouting. And he said, the Lord struck me blind. He said, uh, uh, he said, I went to every old witchcraft doctor, every old conjurer I could find to try to get help from my eyes. Said, finally, my brother took me to see a doctor. And the doctor unwrapped the bandage from my eyes, and he said, my God, said there's nothing I can do for this man, nothing anybody else can do for him. He said, take this, home, this man home and let him die. Now, if you'd have seen that fellow, and I suppose he's dirty, and I don't know what all, uh, but if, you'd have, if you had seen him, you'd have said, surely, that man will never amount to anything. But he said, my brother took me back to that one little room where I lived and left me. And I sat down and I began to think of Jesus that I had persecuted. And I wondered if Jesus would do anything for me. He said, I... Uh, I got down on my knees and I called Jesus the lily of the valley. I called him the bright and the morning star. I called him all the pretty names that I could think of but said it didn't do a bit of good. But said then I began to tell him how sorry, low down, and mean I was. And I said, Jesus, if you'll give me back my eyesight, and if you'll save my soul, I'll go out from here and I'll preach. He said, I didn't see Jesus when he came into that little room that morning. But he said, I felt him like a clap of thunder when he hit my soul. <laughs> and uh, uh, that man, Clevin Darius, he wrote, have a little talk with Jesus. Oh. You ought to have been there when... Uh, when he blessed my soul. Uh, when, and uh, I want the light from the lighthouse to shine on me. We'll soon be done with troubles and trials. So God can take a nobody <laughs> yeah. Amen. and make somebody. Hallelujah. Amen. He can take a sot and make a preacher out of it. <laughs> or a United States senator. How about that? <laughs> or a great they, songwriter. Well, <laughs> yes, it's him. Glory. What was his name? Clevin Derricks. Wow. He wrote, Have a Little Talk with Jesus. Um, when God dipped his love in my heart, uh, we'll, soon be, we'll soon be done. Yeah. We'll soon be done with troubles and trials. <laughs> God specializes Amen. in making something or somebody out of nobody. Yes. Amen. Amen. Well, I tell you, you've preached to some good sermons here tonight. <laughs> Haven't you enjoyed this? Amen. I tell you, this is wonderful. You've got to come back and do this often. 
Be I'm glad to. But you mean like this? United States senator was uh, was so down. A truck driver, he's going to take his life. Yeah. Yeah. And had had it had ready to pull the trigger, but he decided it's the wrong place. You know. Yeah. He, he wouldn't. But on the way to the bathroom. <laughs> <laughs> Jesus changed his life. Isn't that great? We've heard so much of. Uh, <laughs> Everybody's heard of um, uh, oh, the drunk that um, uh, that while his little girl was male trotter. Yeah, male trotter. Male trotter. Yeah. You know how that he was so addicted to drink that while his little girl was uh, lying a corpse, he slipped her shoes off and went pond them for a drink of liquor. Man. But he staggered into the Union Pacific Garden Mission. Yeah. <laughs> One night, I passed that place. I pastored in that area. I yeah. passed that place a lot of times, yeah. and I thought about the lives had been changed wow. there. Yeah, he became his, one of the greatest evangelists of his day. Right. His Amen. was the only one. This others, uh, oh yeah, Billy Sunday, or some of them, I think. Oh yeah, Billy Sunday was saved there. Yeah. Yeah, I've got his testimony. Wow. <laughs> and Billy Sunday's going to be one of these featured in this series of evangelists later on this year. Oh, yeah. But uh, listen, just to, just before we go to Dan at the phones, 